Hello there everyone, my name is Ren and welcome to another video. Today we're gonna be continuing where we left off in Blue Archive's main story, Volume F, where all miracles begin. In the last episode, we did the episode called Foreshadowing. And well, there definitely was a lot of foreshadowing on what's about to come in the next couple of episodes. So I'm very excited to read through all of that and... Uh, Currently, in the main story, Rin and the General Student Council discovered six different energy sightings all throughout Kibotos and was a very strange occurrence and Rin was investigate, decided to investigate about it because of what Sensei reported to her about Sensei's dream and uh, well, there were some people who opposed to the idea like Aoi and uh, um, Kaya was definitely plotting something in the background and uh, well nobody knows that and uh, well, yeah oh my god I'm so bad at explaining I'm so sorry anyways uh, Nisir Summit operational wait what operational plan has well arrived finally alongside with the Mika banner which I pulled and never got her as you can see my pyro scenes are gone <sighs> SMH my head anyways since it got released um, earlier I was just um, planning to well binge read binge read oh binge read all up to the latest episode so uh i'm gonna do this recording um overnight and just cut it into different parts and upload it um, every other day so uh yeah anyways without further ado let's get right into the story i'm sorry it's i'm taking so long hibiki and that's Convening the Emergency Response Committee. Okay. Oh, come on. Why is it loading so slow? The request to convene the emergency response committee was sent to each district. <coughs> oh my god, I'm sorry. This. What is it, Ayane? Sakurako. A message from the General Student Council. Oh, hello, Mini. Nagi! The General Student Council seeks to form an emergency response committee. How many years has it been? I heard Sensei reported our prophetic dream to the General Student Council. Could that be the catalyst? The General Student Council isn't the type to enact such drastic measures over a hunch. There's likely more to this than we know. However, I have not laid any of my trust with the General Student Council since the President disappeared. While Nanakami Rin, the proxy, has been harmless enough, it would be foolish of us to blindly follow her lead. The raging storm within the uh, um, Council since the President's disappearance has been obvious to all. We need to discuss the situation with Sensei before anything else. As of now, I don't see any reason to turn it down. Sensei will be by our side. We may not be in the majority with our decisions to attend. However, I see here the Pandemonium Society, Melanium's big sister, the Red Dictator, and even the Dark Monarch were invited. I find it unlikely a meeting with such a cast can run smoothly. I'm apprehensive of the political strife that may ensue. Oh my god! 
my gosh! Nagi, Seiya, what you doing up there? XD, XD, XD. Ah, Mika, why did you not come home? Mika? Oh, wow, let me see. The General Student Council is requesting all tea party members to attend an emergency response community meeting. That sounds so dramatic. I guess I don't have a choice, do I? What should I wear? I'll need to curl my hair too. Hmm? Gena and the Panibon Young Society will be there too? <sighs> Mika? Please? Please what, Nagi? Please don't cause trouble. Don't you know me by now? <laughs> Since he's gonna be there, right? I have to impress them with how much I've grown. Hello, poison girl. <sighs> I already have an, a headache. Makoto, you stupid fucking idiot. If only you weren't the arrow type of character, I w probably would have loved you. Well, your design is cool and all, but personality-wise, yeah. Our opportunity has finally come, Iroa. It's time. Time for what? We will rise to the occasion and prove the might of the Pandemonium Society to the General Student Council in Shali itself. I intercepted the message before it could reach the pre victim. <laughs> we'll carry out our plan without their unbearable meddling. At least tell me what your plan is, Makoto. The General Student Council isn't going to just plop us down next to Trinity. You're not that damn dumb. Well, hopefully Sensei can keep things from devolving into a total disaster. You have 51,234 unread messages. You have 51,235 unread messages. Jeep, this. Don't make a fuss, I know. Yes, ma'am. It is not my place to interfere, but I should be aware of what transpires. Kaho! I find it strange that the General Student Council would invite us. We're remote both geographically and politically. Nia? <laughs> oh, fuck you, Nia. Oh my god. Probably my most hated character. Besides Cherino. <sighs> They've been contacting us more often this day, 7th day, Kaho. Oh. <laughs> That's not a laughing matter, Nia. Yeah. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. oh my god, I'm gonna stop. Perhaps you're right. If Yako Yako If Yaka Yoran was around, we could leave such annoyances to them. Hello Labour Party members. Where's um Minori? I haven't seen the prison president lead. What's going on? You didn't hear? She's hiding in the mountains because of the most recent coup. Another one? Who we'll staged it this time? Eh, who cares? Wasn't the first won't be the last. Wanna take bets on how long she'll be gone this time? Sensei, the General Student Council sent us an email. Senior Administrator Rin assembled the student group separate. Uh, representatives of the main districts for what's known as an emergency response committee and Rins attached some separate da data just for you. It says that masses with ultra high energy have been observed all over Kibotas. But the masses are invincible uh, invisible. The goal of the emergency response committee is for the districts to cooperate with each other to find out the cause and truth behind this phenomenon. It's gonna be difficult to organize all the different district students, so they've requested Sensei's presence to help. Thanks for the summary, Arona. That's my job. They're sending an escort to come retrieve you soon. You're an important person, so they're covering all security concerns. In the meantime, I'll look more into the information Rin gave us. I'll let you know if I find anything out. 
can always count on me. Thank you. Oh, a chopper. Sensei, we're here to pick you up. Hello, Miss Ogage po Police Force. <laughs> Wait, didn't Kayang um uh requested Valkyrie to escort us while she was um plotting something? Oh no. Oh no. Something's wrong. I can feel it. We will be your escort to the Sanctum Tower, the General Student Council's current base of operations. Valkyrie? Yes, we have prepared the helicopter at Shalis Emergency Heliport. This way, please. Wow. Nice, um, choices. Okay. It seems excessive to use a tactical transport helicopter just to pick me up. Well, we're a, we are a police school. We have the resources to provide this kind of support to someone so important. Um, the rock emo tubes. <laughs> and seeing how there's barely enough bu budget for bullets this day, I can't be selfish. Kirino, discount Kiana. At this rate, I'm going to be wielding a pea shooter against a plane thrower, or worse. Wait, Valkyrie has no budget. So, yeah, it's definitely suspicious, Sensei. You're not Valkyrie students. The heck, where did you come from? Kaiser PMC. You pick up on things quickly, Sensei, although not quickly enough. We've secured Shalice, Sensei. Good job. Then continue with the next phase. Ah, Kaya. <laughs> I'm guessing the mission was a success, General. Who the heck is this? General. Yes, we have secured Shalice Sensei. You look like you're from GFL or something. Indeed. The emergency response committee will be crippled without Sensei and the chief officer's authority will plummet. Which brings us one step closer to our goal of dismantling Shale. Are? What? Oh. We finally know your motives, Chief of Defense. We've never had any interest in your idea of justice. Dismantling Shale isn't to our advantage at this point. Without your knowing, our plans changed a long time ago. President, it's me. Hello, General. Are we proceeding according to plan? Yes, everything is running smoothly. Who the heck is this? Excellent. As we've secured the artifact in the desert, we no longer have any need for the General Student Council's forces. And with that, the cooperation of the Defense Office. The material is also a petty waste of time. With the artifact, we can act of our own accord. I'm gonna give him this um, accent just because it kinda fits. Proceed to occupy the General Student Council. We will si simultaneously secure administrative control of the Sanctum Tower. Then Kaiser Corporation will finally seize control of Kibotos from the hands of the General Student Council. Mm -hmm. Don't worry, they won't cause any trouble. Understood. Wait until the emergency response committee meeting ends at the specified area. Once the general student council room is defenseless, we will take over. Our target is the chief de officer of the general student council and the chairman. But remember, the chief officer is a priority. Yes, sir. What should we do with the chief of defense? Transfer her to the prison at the PMC headquarters. Even her soldiers won't be able to find her there. 
The emergency response committee will fall to the pieces without sensei or the ship of, Bresen, uh, of the defense press. When we occupied the general student council in the present executor's administrative control over Sanctum Tower, martial law will be declared on the DU. Then, the plan will move on to the second stage. General, what should we do with Sensei? Lock Sensei up somewhere, no one will find him, and don't let them move a muscle, even if it means shooting a limb. Understood. At gunpoint. Well, looks like Sensei got shot again. Well, I'm very excited to what's coming. So, let's continue. Arrival of the light. The light. You mean suzerain? <laughs> oh my god, I'm making all these jokes. Shiroko, everyone's waiting. Hurry up. Shiroko, we have to get going. We're late. I'm going as fast as I can. I'm almost there. Don't go too fast, Shiroko. And don't talk while you're riding your bike. You still have to stay safe. Yes, understood. See you soon. <laughs> After being rejected so many times, we're finally meeting with the General Student Council. <sighs> Seriously, it used to make me so angry that I've even considered wiping out the General Student Council. Look at us now. The General Student Council? Oh, you know, wouldn't that be too much even for you? Of course it is. Hey, I'm old with back pains now. I was just reminiscing about when I was a feisty youth like you. <laughs> that really wasn't too long ago. I, it may not, it may have not been too long ago, but everything is different. We have Sensei now. I don't know why I've been so nostalgic recently. Recently, remember when you showed up out of nowhere, Nanami, and meeting Shiroko for the first time? You're acting like an old fart with what you're doing, Oshino. I've actually never heard the story of you and Shiroko meeting meeting for the first time. Really? I've never talked about it. Shiroko was a wild girl when we first met. It took me and Nonomi a lot of work to capture her. What do you mean by capture? Oshino, that story is... We don't need to hide anything anymore, Nonomi. I don't want to either, but it's difficult. Shiroko doesn't remember much before coming to Abydos. She had amnesia? What? Are we in a soap opera or something? Well... Something's off here. What do you mean? Shiroko? I've never seen such a huge scale of BMC troops like this. Trucks, tanks, soldiers, still, they're all heading toward the same place. They're, they're going to Abydos Desert? I need to check this out. Sh Shiroko? What do you think you're doing? It's way too dangerous. Come on now, Shiroko. Let's group up and we'll figure it out together. I'll be careful. I'm go only going to scout out the situation and report back. Maybe this has something to do with why Sensei called us. Hey. The ground shook just now. Was that an earthquake? I see a strange light. It's kind of dark. No, it's like a rainbow. What is this? Whoa. Nani? Are you an idiot? How can you miss from this close? I don't understand. Is the barrel bent or something? Okay, then I'll just aim like this. A percussion failure? What? You fool. Let, let me do it. Wait, the journal said not to kill. No way. How did even a single bullet? 
What is this? As long as I'm here, no one will hurt Sensei. Oh, Arana, you're protecting me? Just like how you protected me from the missile back in Aiden Treaty? Wow. I, Super Arona, the OS the Shy Temches, am Sensei's guardian. This is your chance, Sensei. Nigirunda yo! Oh? Nari? Oh. Oh my god, I was trying to take a screenshot. Something is coming. What was that? An earthquake? Arona? My head. Sensei passed out. We just had to make sure they didn't run away, so this'll do. Let's move Sensei to the destination. I can feel it from here too. This. The chroma. Shiroko, what's happening? Come back! Come back now! Oh my god, these are so, um, what do you call this? These are thumbnail worthy. Okay, that's definitely a thumbnail. Shiroko, please answer. Pick up the phone. Shiroko! Sh she's not picking up. What the heck is she doing? Shiroko, answer you, baka. Oh, uh, what should we do? Let's keep it together, Ayane. Contact Sensei. They'll know what to do. Y you're right. Okay, Sensei. I can't get a hold of Sensei either. Sensei either? What's happening? Wait, she picked up. Shiroko? Shiroko, are you there? Shiroko? Can you hear me? Say something. What's happening over there? Are you okay? Shiroko, please. Shiroko. We lost her again. Sh Shiroko! Oh no. No, no, me is um sad. Uh, that was so empty. Next episode. Well. I'm gonna stop this for now at this part for the next video so uh yeah anyways i hope you enjoyed that and see you in the next one bye